Today was, uh, we were hoping to sail over 80 degrees north, but uh, it doesn't, doesn't look like, doesn't look like much wind. We are like on 78, seven, no, we are, we are on 79.48, so it's like 50 nautical north from here. But we'll see how far we'll get today because it's just open ocean and I would like to sail up there but hopefully there might be a little wind we'll see when we come out there and we have been anchored here for the whole day yesterday because it was so foggy and now we're taking up the anchor so we have 40 meters left she says big glacier I don't remember the name but the, the it doesn't seems to be coughing so there is no ice here I, I'd say the uh, glacier is called the Holmia glacier or Holmia something. glacier because yeah. this is the Holmia Bukta yeah I think <laughs> I will go back and take the, the helm. So we anchored about 17 meters or 20 or close there because we've been told that kelp doesn't grow over under a certain amount of depth. And um, so far I think it's true. So we have, we might have changed our mind about uh, today's uh, adventure, and uh, it looks the the sun came out and it looks like a really fine day. So we are probably, most probably anyway, going to Moffen. Uh, we can't go ashore to Moffen, and we have to stay like 300 meters from it, but. Uh, Anyway, I think we will go there, just because we can. Yeah, it is a beautiful day and I don't think there is often days that you can actually go to the mountain. No. And this year there is absolutely no ice surrounding us, we don't see any drift ice. So, we would just say, why not? And then we hope the wind comes. Yes, we hope the wind will come so we can sail it. So, it's a motoring day. Svalbard again, I must say. It has been some sailing, but some motoring as well. Oh, there's Frederick. A lot of motoring, yes. But today I think it's a good course. Or, or a good course, what do you say? Yeah. Because we are aiming for often. Are you happy about aiming for often? I don't know if happy is the right word, but uh, yeah. It will, it will give you some satisfaction. Probably, yes. Muffin is a bit um, like a mythical thing. A lot of people want to go there, and in the old days, for some people, like in the 1982, we read about a couple, and they could not go there. Because the island was surrounded by ice, but the pack ice was so far south so they could actually go up there and uh, touch that ice anyway which is rather impossible for us to do because it is at least a hundred nauticals away yeah otherwise we would have wanted to do that as well wouldn't we maybe maybe and and uh, and Moffen, the whole the, the island is about 80 degrees so if we get to Moffen, we will be about 80 degrees north That we would like very much. Now, filming right into the sun and he's just disappearing, isn't he? Or is he making a U-turn coming back? One never knows. 
but I better get inside because I don't have any winter clothes on out here and only socks on my feet in the Arctic it is cold you can see here that we are getting closer to the end of the world or, or the end of the shards so we are here and here is 80 degree north that is Moffen and uh, so the sea map stops at 80 degrees north uh, the Navionic shards who we have over here they stop at 79.50 so the, the goal is set for today and that is 80 north and we added on to see Moffat but from a distance that is yeah. but uh, hopefully uh, oh, it cleared up again it was fogging up really bad but now we can see we have we have another bo boat in front of us with Jochen and Morning Haze. Who, yeah, he kind of set us on track on Moffen because we did not see that we should go to Moffen, but he, he said, yeah, you can anchor there, 300 uh, minimum 300 meters from it. Yeah, because it is a nature reserve and a bird reserve. Yeah. yeah. And uh, it's a, it's like a sandbank, so it's like 20 meters deep, very far away from the island. So that's not. But I don't think we can stay there long because there is, of course, a swell. Yeah, and also uh, they say that uh, the, the guidebook says that if you anchor there, uh, the walruses might come out and say hello to you because it's uh, also a, a summer place for the walruses to yeah. be. Yeah, there is supposed to be a lot of walruses. Mm -hmm. Oh, we've seen them already. They're huge. They are big. And they're not pretty. No. Can you say that? Yeah, you can say that. We are getting closer to the big moment where we will leave the shark and pass 80 degrees north. Yeah. I think this will be kind of a big uh, thing for us. It's, a bit, it's like a milestone in our sailing uh, career, so to say. Yeah, to be up at 80 north. Yeah. Now it will change. Have a look. The moment of truth. 92, 93, 94, 95. Eighty North, welcome to Eighty North, my dear. <laughs> Thank you, and you are most welcome too. Yeah. This is great. I think we need to celebrate this. Are you a happy woman? Yes, I am. I almost. Um, you got a little emotional. I got emotional here. Yes, we have, we have actually uh, sailed here. Actually, yeah. To, to be it, honest, we you have to use the motor to come okay, up here because okay. there is we no wind. We came here with our own boat. And yeah. We sailed as much as we could, and we are at eighty. Yeah. So this is very interesting. Yeah, yeah. It's a bit. It's a. It's a, it's a milestone for us. It is. Yeah. yeah. Ooh. And, very. Uh, also for me now, or for us to go go to Moffen as well. Yeah, mm -hmm. Moffen is just over there. So we have, have maybe 40 minutes or so to go. Yeah. This was shit because it started to rain a little bit here when we came to uh, to uh, Moffen, who is yeah you can see it's a very low land, and we have to stay safe distance. And uh, so I don't want to fly the drone in rain. So we'll see. We 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 are going around Moffen now, and we will see. Uh, maybe the rain stops, and then we could fly. Hopefully, just cross our fingers for that.
Rivers run dry, dust spreads in the air Two dark days, do you have a tear to spare? Make a promise, the world awaits It's heavy, just breathing through this debate we are at Moffen. Morning Haze is also here. And you have Moffen in the background. Now we are leaving Moffen behind us. And uh, we went, we did circumnavigate it. I will show you here. So we came from there and went around it. There around it and a safe distance and now we're going down to Mushamna which is a very sheltered anchorage we had something in the water there is this a walrus? walrus yeah, yeah, yeah. We're meeting a walrus here. We are celebrating a little bit that we passed 80 degrees north. Yeah. So we opened a little small bottle of champagne. Yeah. And cheers. Che cheers. 80 degrees north. Yes. <laughs> we had to motor and because there was absolutely no wind. Yeah. Mm. And we also had a bonus and that was we rounded Moffen. Yeah. And we were not planning to go to Moffen. No, nah, not at all. No. But, but because we talked to uh, Morning Haze. Yeah, Jochen on Morning Haze. Yeah. Mm. Uh, he and he said, was going there. He was going there. And it's we like, said, why not? Yeah. Because the weather at that time was really, really yeah. nice. Mm. No window, but. Uh, nice and calm sea. Yeah. Mm. So. But, and, and we went. Uh, Went around and um, yeah. came back, and uh, the, the closer we got to the mainland, the uh, rain came. Yeah. You can have a look outside here. So now we're in Mushamna in uh, Woodfjorden. Yes, so and celebrating. Yeah, this is as little, far. This is as far as we're going to go, isn't it? We're going from go east. This to is east. where we will turn around yeah. Yeah, and start to go back. Yeah. And we're going to do some visits here in Woodfjorden, yeah. but after that, yeah. yeah. So, well, big celebration for us. Cheers. To you, 80 degrees north <laughs> and muffin. And muffin. Yeah. 